To a contact at 7 Investigation now out of Parker, a woman called us, says she's fed up with what's going on in her backyard. Her home backs up to the Black Bear Golf Club. She bought the home, well aware of the dangers of errant golf balls, but now she says it's gotten worse than ever, and she wants something done about it. Denver 7's Eric Lufer looked into the matter to see if anything could be done. We're just getting drilled with golf balls constantly. And Leslie Stevens has the proof, golf ball after golf ball scattered in her backyard. If you kind of look down here, so I mean, if we count them, so we got one over there, one, two, three, four. Her house backs up to hole four at Black Bear Golf Club in Parker, the tee box just a couple hundred yards away. I can be sitting here having a cup of coffee, eating. Golf balls will just go sailing past my head. This was the latest casualty, a broken window on the second floor of her home. It's not just the cost of broken windows. It's becoming a life-threatening um, issue that needs to be addressed. Stevens wants the golf course to do something, maybe move the tee box or line the right side of the fairway with some trees. We reached out to Black Bear Management. They had no comment on the specific complaint, but said they always try to work with their neighbors. Meantime, we found this, the rules and regulations regarding the neighborhood, talking about assumption of risk and that homeowners are, quote, subject to inherent risk, including damage or injury to person or property, end quote. In other words, unless a golfer knocks on your door and accepts blame and offers to pay for the damage their golf ball made, the homeowner has to pay. Okay, so I have one right there on the couch. Leslie knows she took the risk seven years ago to live in the line of fire. And that's true, and I understand that, and I accept it. But it gets to the point where it's, if it's so bad that the golf course uh, should really look at, you know, what is going on in this particular spot. In Parker, I'm Eric Lufer, Denver 7. And Leslie tells us she's been in contact with state senators. Her goal is to get a new law on the books to better protect homeowners who live on a golf course. We'll keep you posted on that. If you have a tip or a problem you think we should look into, call Contact 7. It's 720-462-7777. You can also send us an email at contact7 at thedenverchannel.com.